Right, Duncan is uh, about 18 seconds behind these girls now in fourth place. And that is going to put her two points behind Nancy van der Ven. Fontanese one point further back and she's... Oh. Livia Lancelot getting the elbows out on that Kawasaki. Back marker. Oh. <laughs> it's treacherous out there. A load of mobile chicanes for the girls to deal with as they come through. We are on the final two laps here. Van der Ven is already down towards the end of pit lane and beyond, heading towards the finish line to pick up the one lap board any moment now. She's got a 21 second advantage over Chiara Fontanese, who is digging deeper than she's ever had to dig before to keep Lancelot at bay. Girl down in the first turn. Oh! Van der Ven, sorry, Fontanese and Lancelot go either side. And I think that was very close for Livia Lancelot. She's got good drive coming out of turn two. There's a pass on here. Back markers ahead of the two girls battling for second and third in the race here. Fontanese goes to the inside. Lancelot goes around the outside. She goes past Fontanese. Oh, great move back from Lancelot. What has Fontanese got left in store? She goes to the inside. She knows she's got a go back after the French girl, the defending champion. Over the line for the penultimate time and onto the final lap. And it's Lancelot now in second. Fontanese has been pushed back to third. That changed the championship again. Because we're back to five points separating the top four girls. We wait for Duncan to come through, but she should still be there in fourth place. She is. 35 seconds down.